Hello everybody, it's Tom and Jerry Fan 64 and it's not time to do a movie review The Pretty Woman, the 1990 movie. In which, um... I'm I'm also going to be doing a double feature movie to Runaway Bride. I was going to review Runaway Bride in a separate video, but I'm going to review it. But first, let's start with my movie The Runaway Bride. And, and I'm, I, one Gary, I do have a Gary Marshall movie on VHS that is um, The Other Sister 1999 VHS. 1999 which are Joe Lewis, Diane Keaton, Tom and Giovanni Ribsy. Directed by the late Gary Marshall, rest in peace. This is a... This is a Hollywood video run. All must see films is NBC TV. Um, remind me to copy about I hope to get this movie on TV. This one I got for a, from a garage sale for free back in 2020. Four stars is box TV. You'll fall in love with the other sisters NBC TV. Rated PG 13 is 130 minutes. I hope to get the DVD. This one incredible now is a hologram. Recommend to sit the friends like movie the friends I can't recommend yet. This one had a Hollywood video only, which I reveal tore off the reveal of printed. Printed is August 19th, 1999. I do have the movie on the Princess Diaries put on November 13th, 2001. This one, Runaway Bride, I used to have the, two, the Paramount Picture Special Edition VHS. That was a 2003 print, but I got rid of it for no reason. I have to get the VHS back question. And uh, Pretty Woman, I used to have the um, the uh, the VHS with the pink with the pink eagle that I got from my late friend Darcy. who sadly passed away recipes, but I, I had to get rid of my VHS of Pretty Woman, unfortunately, because I wasn't allowed to watch that. I have to get the VHS back question. I have to get the pink eagle VHS back question. I have to get the 2004 reprint VHS, hopefully. And I did find the DVD of Pretty Woman for $2.99 at the good one because you were only less than two years ago, but I didn't get it. I have to get it on DVD. And Pretty Woman I watched on Max and Runaway Bride uh, is a 1999 movie starring Julia Roberts and Richard Gere. Also stars Gary, Joan Cusack, Hector Rosal, and Maria Wilson Paul Fun fact, Joan Cusack is actually John Cusack's sister. This is directed by the late Gary Marshall for his Special features get the actual trailer commentary director Gary Marshall and Dixie Chicks music video Ready to Run. This is a Paramount Pictures movie, course by touching the pictures both of those are shown. Catch her if you can. Get ready to fall in love with the Roberts and Gere all over again. It's Mike Nolan, ABC TV. Spine back. Big Laughs, Great Stars, The Lakers, Jill Single, Good Morning America, Delightful Recipes, Delightful Left Field, Romantic Comedy, Mike Mike's Doing ABC TV. Ready PG, it's 116 minutes. Here's this. This is a great, great movie. So, yeah. And now let's go on. Is, and like I said, I'm going to give the movie Runaway Bride a 10 out of 10 stars in the bus. Now let's get on to my movie review, The Pretty Woman, which this movie I watched on Max, and I watched the movie Pretty Woman on Max yesterday. And I, I, I watched the movie Emily on Max today. The Pretty Woman is a really, really great movie, and this this movie review to Pretty Woman and Runaway Bride is dedicated to the memory of Gary Marshall, who sadly passed away in 2016. One Gary Marshall movie I used to have on Blu-ray was Valentine's Day, but I got rid of it for no reason. I took it away because I didn't need a Blu-ray. I, I should have donated it. I hope to get the movie of Valentine's Day back on the DVD. I hope to get New Year's Eve on DVD, and I hope to get Gary Marshall's last movie, Mother's Day, on DVD, even though I heard that film's terrible, but I will get it for the collection. And, uh... The movie, the movie Pretty Woman is a really great movie. And fun fact, Gary Marshall has a, has a, had a sister, Penny Marshall, rest in peace. So if you guys haven't seen the movie Runaway Bride and Pretty Woman, I highly recommend the both. But Pretty Woman is definitely my new favorite romance movie. And all, I, I think Pretty Woman is my number one favorite romance movie. My number one favorite romance movie used to be the Before Trilogy, but now it's Pretty Woman. And I think Pretty Woman, honestly, is my favorite, my number one favorite Julia Roberts movie. It's a great, great movie. And one movie with another one of my favorite Julia Roberts movies that no, doesn't get enough credit is Notting Hill, which I used to have Notting Hill on VHS, but it got rid Nothing bad because VHS, nothing in DVD. I hope that Notting Hill and Pretty Woman and Runaway Bride get 4K releases. And Pretty Woman is a great movie, and just to let you guys know, this movie is not a pr contains scenes not appropriate for young that are not appropriate for younger viewers. So yeah, so this movie I only rec like the movie Amelie. I only recommend this movie to tw people 21 and older. So yeah. I'm going to give Pretty Woman and Runaway Bride a 10 out of 10 stars in A+. Plus. Yeah, that is it for my movie reads of Pretty Woman and Runaway Bride. In which I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you're generous enough, please consider leaving a like on this video. Subscribe plus it really helps out. And if you guys want to, please comment down below what do you think of my haircut. So yeah, I'll see you guys in my next movie review. It'll be a movie review on Four Weddings and the Funeral. So I'll see you guys then. Adios.